Cancers, welcome to your mid-November heart spread read in the urban jungle of Cancun, Mexico. I'm shaking the camera. Um, yeah, it's a humble studio. <laughs> we got people do work a couple of houses away, so I hope we can work through it. Um, you hear me all right? It's normally very peaceful. Should be taking a lunch here soon. So this reads the one that you're thinking of, the one that's on your mind, the one that's in your heart. And, uh, eight card read. I look at you and your person. First house, seventh house, your anima, your animus. Um, look at how you're interacting. Get some advice from spirit. Look at their relationship as a whole, if there is one. If not, I shift the advice to you, whoever's watching. Cancers. Mid-November time frame. Emperor. Okay, when this comes in, this is you. In and around relationships, where your mind and heart is at. Baseline energy, kind of you. Uh, separate from other people, just as you are. Uh, and this cancer is, the energy is, I am not settling. A little stubborn, firm, you know what you want. Like you've done, you've done figured it out. You know now, you have, you, the scroll comes out and it's like, an, you know, it's like, nope, 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 nope. And that's where you're at in terms of love, cancer. <laughs> yeah. So, who's going to come up against the emperor, you know, I mean, the hair font here, um, you, um, you, you probably are looking for something serious, though, you know, but you ain't playing, you're going through, and, you know, in terms of uh, dating or something, it's like, if, if you don't feel like they're the one, you probably wouldn't even text with them, more or less, just go out with them, um, and um, I mean, you could say it's kind of great energy to come into a relationship with. It's a, a commanding energy uh, in terms of a relationship. Um, could be uh, honestly like a master manifester here, master manifester. And look what you have is facing you is this little page of cups. They're so sweet. Huh. Cancer, someone younger than you, someone sweet, someone sincere, someone emotionally vulnerable. Someone who adores you, and I mean they adore you. It's like they offer themselves up to you. They see you on a pedestal. They see you as being above them. They see themselves as probably not being good enough. But man, are they sincere, and they are like really, really in love with you. It's just so strong. Uh, but it's like a crush. It's like a crush. You mean something to him, to them, the Hierophant here. You mean a lot more than just what you are. So yeah, they're heavily projecting. It's not just a father or mother or authority. Um, it's not just submission like that. Uh, this emotionally is this uh, recognition of um, uh, kind of a spiritual truth and wisdom um, that they admire that's why they look up to it I mean I, it could truly be said that they hold you on a pedestal you know right or wrong I whether you deserve to be there or not not my business but they do and let's see how you're reacting about that now this is you how you're reacting to them just shows me how you're reacting to them what are you thinking about them now that you're engaging them Separate from the Hierophant. Well, what's the Hierophant going to do? Page of Pentacles, going to examine them. Uh, this is examining carefully here before you offer this page. Look, it's uh, tentative. She's thinking about it. You get the feeling she really likes it, though. She's looking at that coin, and she's thinking, like, man, I really like this. It's, uh, you know... Um, something I, I really I really uh, could in, invest in here something I'd like to have you know something you want to possess I gotta say it's coming that way the energy like it's like you want to possess them uh, cancers now, I'm not saying that's bad but that's the energy of it 
and there's a little bit of an energy with them like you find them to be adorable you may use the word adorable for the first time in your life about a member of the opposite sex it, that has a sexual connotation um, but there's an element of it it's like you just want to scoop them up in your arms like a puppy uh, that part of the love you know um, and that, I think that's what's got you really looking at them hard here you coming in with your list of absolutes with the hair blonde here ace of pentacles <laughs> they're meeting your energy perfectly which was exactly what you would uh, want I believe and I will weigh the bottom of the deck we have the star page of pentacles so that's a step up uh, ace of pentacles I mean not the page so a step up uh, with the ace of pentacles from the page of cups now uh, with you looking at the page of pentacles too with you in that page of pentacles energy you're looking at the nuts and bolts you're thinking things through you're taking it seriously they are too they're meeting that and they're now they're really thinking about it it's like because honestly they just are all in I mean they're all in for you if you if there's any doubt about their sincerity cancer nix that they are 100 percent this is real sincerity here like maybe they say something and it's just so goopy or whatever you're just like please seriously you can't possibly be sincere but i think they are at any level stars the overall energy i told you you could be a master manifester here uh cancer this hair font energy here hmm this is your advice towards them from spirit. Hmm, let me see what their advice for you is. The Queen of Pentacles. Wow. Okay, this Three of Wands, it's not about any kind of third party anything. Um, it's a two of wands or choice three of wands is actions. It's the Gemini. It's the third house It's very active here. Uh, they're literally actions And this is your advice and how to engage them and it's coming under the page of Pentacles So the page of Pentacles is going to be hesitant energy um, The three of wands is not that's going for it. Uh, this could be a romance phase. This could be uh, You coming, you know you're the hair of font. Maybe you've kind of been in the monastery a little while. You need to get out and just have some fun and, and live and come alive. And over here with your person, uh, Cancers, it's clearly showing there's a relationship here. And your advice, if you're cross-watching, please do share this with your person. But their advice is, it's corny. Realize that you're not a page. And you, your ace means a lot uh, because it's backed up. By the queen of pentacles you're actually dealing with the queen of pentacles here guys so you know you could be uh, dealing cancers with an earth sign person sun moon rising or venus earth sign dominant person uh, maybe even an earth moon too it's got that feeling here someone um it's very solid and very balanced and um you know i think what it is they really love about you is your spiritual depth flat out your spiritual depth you got it you got the to them you're the real deal you're the gravitas and they really just admire it and for a very humble way this is them saying you know i really admire you my love their love just goes out for you they love what you are cancer and look at this the page of wands the page of wands is looking back at you okay so we need to light this relationship up um a lot of pages here there's new energy there's tender energy uh, there's some you know maybe surprise energy if i could call it like maybe you didn't expect it to be this amazing you were kind of in the mood to sort of re reject something and the way they approached you ace of pentacles to your page queen of pentacles to your three of wands um and with the advice being a page of wands it's hard not to see that you guys need to fire this up with your romantic talk. You know, I wouldn't even think this would be a question, but I, 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 now I'm thinking of someone. And so maybe you don't normally romantic talk. Maybe it's time. Uh, maybe you don't normally go on dates. This is saying it's time. 
you know, um, you know, go out and have some fun. Go away for the weekend. Go to the beach. Go to the mountains. You know, um, and spend some time together, romantic time together. Think about when you were kids. Wow, the three of swords is the outcome. Slayed me with this one, spirit. Did not see this one coming. Clarify this out with the world. Page of Pentacles reversed. And a Knight of Cups. So, I want to get an idea of what happened. Hmm. Page of Pentacles reversed and the Knight of Cups. Clarify out this uh, uh, outcome here of the Three of Swords. Um, which I think is clear what that is. Um, this relationship um, doesn't work um, in spite of the advice from spirit. You know, we have the advice as well, oh, free will, don't you have free will? Yeah, I always have free will. We do exactly what we want, you know, we, got, we have that. So we have the world, the Five of Pentacles, and the Knight of Cups. I think this is referring to you uh, in when a, a relationship read uh, fails, um, you know, this person's coming to you with this uh, page energy. Um, and you're, again, I told you, you're in this hair font energy. Um, and I think like you, you really think about it and you really try and you're really drawn to them sexually. And here's what I think is happening is they're uh, uh, kind of lit you up. They kind of like you, you, uh, a relationship wasn't a reality for you until this person and now it's like uh, you can't like unring the bell you can't unring the bell comes to mind so now you know this is on your mind and I think you're gonna be with the five of Pentacles in reverse uh, th this whole experience shows that you you do not operate from lack mentality uh, it's the opposite. You really are trying to decide. You are not settling, and you are trying to decide on that basis, and it's not from a, a lack mentality. It's from you, the opposite, you wanting the world, you knowing that you're ready for this new cycle, and that's what you want in a mate, or else you'll just be single. Imagine it's the energy that goes with this. But now with the final outcome being the Knight of Cups, you move on from this relationship really leveling up really having a way better idea of kind of exactly what's possible exactly what you want and you'll be able to move on confidently because this moves into the reading to your knight of cups and take action and love now guys moving forward so it's a blessing in disguise so thank you like thumbs up tell a friend tell a friend i do appreciate it if you subscribe thank you guys